girly games squared meow Hey guys, welcome to another episode of Unboxing with Bimo. We have another comic block for you guys. I do believe this is number five um, of the comic blocks. So let's open her up and find what's inside. Ho ho ho! Oh, this is super cool. This is actually really awesome. Uh, a little bit of backstory here. I just recently started uh, reading a comic... Um, that a friend of mine recommended. Uh, it was in the prize box for Comic Block. I do believe they were handing out the graphic, are they, are they graphic novels or the comics. I'm not really sure. I've been reading them online so instead of physical copies. Um, but this is super, super cool. Uh, this is from Saga. Um, check it out, guys. If you are, of course, above the ages of 18. Because there is a lot of nudity. In fact, um, this guy right here... Which I do believe is um, is Prince Robot. I do believe he is Prince Robot. Um, you meet him having some lovely um, doggy style lovins <laughs> with a female robot. I don't know what to call her. Do you call them femme robots? I don't know. So he is. I do believe he is Prince Robot. I've met. Prince Robot and Baron Robot so far. Um, I've only actually gotten through half of the first one because I was reading it on my lunch hour. Uh, <laughs> but that is super, super cool that I just started reading that like yesterday and I get a t-shirt today. Um, so that's super, super cool. Awesome t-shirt. Uh, our collectible today is the Green Lantern Light Up Ring with Mr. Hal Jordan. And that totally is um, Ryan Reynolds. Hal Jordan <laughs> on that packaging. So you have this kind of cool uh, light up ring. That's that's all right. That is an improvement, I'll have to say. An improvement indeed. Our first comic. Oh, guys. Yes. Um, pretty much ever since the first comic block that had this character on the front uh, and never actually had anything to deal with uh, that character. <laughs> um... Uh, we now finally have a comic that better have <laughs> that character on it. Uh, this is Deadpool versus Thanos. <laughs> so the Secret Wars I got in the first one, I do I believe it was Secret Wars. Was it Secret Wars? Yeah, I think it was. Had Deadpool on it, but didn't really have anything to do with Deadpool in the comic itself. Uh, this is super awesome. So it's Deadpool versus Thanos, and he's saying, uh, It was a joke, Marvel. I was joking when I said I wanted to fight Thanos. Like, who wouldn't want to fight? Let's take on Thanos. Let's, come on. I just woke up this morning. Let's go fight Thanos. <laughs> Perfect idea, Deadpool. Um, so the bonus digital edition uh, is also inside. That's pretty cool. Uh, so that is number one. Uh, Deadpool vs. Thanos. That is super, super, super cool. Super awesome! Our second comic in here uh, is Mad Max Fury Road Part 1. That is awesome as well. I just recently watched that movie about a month ago, I believe. Super good. It was, it was a good movie. I will say it was a good movie. Uh, I probably... I compared it in a sense to uh, Death Race with uh, Jason Statham, which I think may have been a better movie, but yeah, that is just my taste. So this is the Mad Max Fury Road Part 1. Uh, I never actually got to see the first Mad Max with Mel Gibson, but uh, maybe it was better, maybe it was not. I can't make that judgment. <laughs> um, but it was an alright movie. Like, the movie was just, it was alright. Uh, it wasn't the best of movies, but it, it was a good movie. I loved the guy on the guitar, just, just yeah, the, the movie itself, the journey, whatever, wasn't completely, I feel like I'd have to watch it again kind of thing, you know? <laughs> so that's really cool that we've got that comic, maybe it'll answer some of the questions that I had from the movie. Um, maybe it'll have nothing to do with the movie, I don't know. Uh, this one, this one's really cool. Uh, this is another relevant thing to me, <laughs> which is super awesome. Uh, this is Mirror's Edge Exordium. Uh, issue one of six. I'm actually playing this game right now. Super, super awesome game. Crazy parkour. Like, you have to, like, roll when you fall and stuff. And there's gunmen coming after you. And really cool. So that is awesome. I know there is a another game coming out next year, I do believe, um, for Mirror's Edge. Super awesome. I might put up some Let's Plays later on. Uh, but I'm just going to play through it as just a, a game for me for now. 
<laughs> this comic block girl, guys, because you think, oh, we've got our collectible, we've got our shirt, uh, we have our three comics, that's it, right? Well, guess what? Comic block threw us off this month. We have a another comic, an extra comic. And this, if you have them on Facebook, is the one that you knew was going to end up in this block. Because um, they did advertise this about three weeks ago, I'm not too sure on the date, uh, that there was going to be a Danger Girl number one. So we have a Danger Girl number one. That's a really awesome, pretty cool, Renegade, says on the bottom there. So that is uh, the comic that they did let us know that was in here. So it's really cool that they, you know, because they told us about this one, they still gave us three others that we didn't know about. So that is indeed really just cool. Thanks. Thanks, guys. Thanks, Comic Block. Thanks, Nerd Block. You guys are awesome. Fourth comic. That's pretty sweet. That is a really, really cool deal. I have slightly the hiccups. Anyway, so let's... I don't think there's anything. There was nothing really special about this card. Um, oh, wait. Uh, Mad Max Fury Road exclusive variant cover. After the credits roll for Mad Max Fury Road, the post apocalypse the post-apocalyptic adventure continues. Explore the waste wasteland in comic book form uh, with the perfect companion to the film. So this actually, the Mad Max uh, comic, is after the movie. So it actually is after you know, after the credits credits roll. The Mad Max Fury Road um, adventure continues in that comic. So that's really cool. Maybe that will definitely answer uh, some of the questions I had from the movie because it is now. Um, a sequel, I guess, to the movie. Without being a sequel to the movie. Because it's not a movie, it's a comic! <laughs> so let's run through everything that we got once again. Uh, the super awesome Saga t-shirt uh, with Prince Robot on there. Really cool. That is a really well-designed t-shirt. Um, I will definitely... Oh, I seriously wear that. I'm probably going to wear that tomorrow. Uh, our collectible was the kind of cool Green Lantern... Kind of cool. Green Lantern. Light up ring. Pretty cool. Pretty awesome. Lights up green. Hal Jordan. Ryan Reynolds. He's gonna be a better Deadpool. <laughs> and then, as we roll through, uh, we got the super awesome bonus comic of Danger Girl number one. Really cool. Looks, I just love, I, I, I don't know. I like the art of comics. I like the illustrations. This is all just looking super awesome. This is probably my favorite comic block yet. Uh, not just because they added an extra comic, but because it is the most, like, things that I know about uh, <laughs> for once. Um, so I got the Mirror's Edge uh, Exordium. Really cool. I'm excited for that. Uh, one of a six. And then the Mad Max Fury Road Part 1. After the credit rolls, the comic continues. So that that is pretty cool. I'm excited to find out, you know, what does happen after the movie. You know, what happens when they... No spoilers! <laughs> and then we got the lovely Deadpool vs. Thanos, which is the one of the ones that I'm really, really excited to read. So I have to say that this one and the Mirror's Edge comic are probably going to be the top two that I will definitely read first. This one's probably number one, just because I have really been waiting for a uh, Deadpool-centric comic that love dab pool. Super awesome. So that is everything that was in our block as we ran through that again. Uh, keep a lookout for a brand new sci-fi block from Nerd Block uh, in the month of November. So we have Star Wars, Back to the Future, Star Trek, Doctor Who, X-Files, Super Troopers, Battlestar Galacta, Planet of the Apes, Stargate SG-1, Firefly, The Terminator, and more. Uh, that is really cool, minus the Doctor Who, because... Don't like Doctor Who. No, don't like him. Just don't like him. That's why I don't have the Nerd Block Classic. <laughs> Just don't want Doctor Who stuff. Um, other than that, though, that block would be just perfect for me. Uh, huge sci-fi nerd, huge uh, tricky, <laughs> all about the Star Wars, you know me. Look at look at this, I got like three obvious things of Star Wars right behind me. And of course all my nerd blocks because I'm hoarding them. No I'm not, I actually store things in them, I'm not hoarding them. But they're really good for storing things. I love my nerd block storage. Anyways guys, that was it for today's episode of this super awesome 
uh, comic block that is definitely hands down my favorite comic block yet. Uh, they definitely stepped it up for this one, so I'm very grateful. Thanks, comic block. Thank you, nerd block. Um, check in for the next episode. I definitely have another one of these coming, as well as another arcade block for next month. Uh, like, share, subscribe, guys. I definitely take feedback very seriously, so if you've got something you want to tell me, you're like, oh, I don't like your face, I can't fix that. But definitely let me know in the comments below what you think of the uh, unboxings, let me think of the channel, definitely check out our Let's Plays, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bemo out. End. Shut up, baby! Baby didn't shut up. Or, not like, shh, baby. Shh. Baby, 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 shut the fuck up. Go to sleep, go to sleep. Baby, baby, God, it stopped baby. crying. It is it working? Baby, never gonna get you up. Never gonna let you down. Never gonna turn something around and desert you. <laughs>